Welcome to the Tickmill Update. I'm Kiana Danielle, the founder of the Investiva Movement. Before we get started, make sure to subscribe to the Tickmill YouTube channel and support us by liking, hearting, and sharing this video with your friends. On Tuesday, we found out that Britain's economy flatlined in the final three months of 2019. The Federal Reserve Chair Jerome Powell told Congress that the U.S. economy is in a good place and oil prices rose about 1% on Tuesday, up from a 13-month low as the number of new coronavirus cases slowed in China, which eased some concerns over the potential uh, lengthy oil demand destruction. On Wednesday, the Fed's Powell testifies before Senate's banking panel. RBNZ governor appears at a parliament select committee and the RBA Governor Lowe participates in a pa panel as well. Today, I'm looking at the Euro-Dollar pair, which followed our Ichimoku strategy perfectly and touched down on the first support level, uh, final support level of 1.0896 on Tuesday before bouncing back up. This level was last touched back in October and acted as a very strong support, which caused the pair to bottom out. So far, from a market sentiment point, it looks like the bears may have finally lost steam and the pair may seek a reversal soon. Now, do you think the euro dollar pair's bloodbath is finally over? Head over to the comment section and let me know. Of course, trading the financial markets involves a risk of loss, and you should only trade the money that you can afford to lose. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our social media, and I will get back to you with more updates tomorrow.